just had breakfast, but before leaving Toulouse, we, uh, we have seen this amazing street art around our area. Um, so I, I think we will go and check them out. So let's go. Completely flooded. Holy moly. Damn. I hope we can park here and, and walk in there. Yeah, I think that's the, yeah. the entry. Yeah, entrance. Entrance. Right. Okay. Yeah. So uh guess who just uh guess who just managed to drive 30 kilometers past Koba and uh, almost uh, drove all the way to Valladolid. It wasn't me. <laughs> and uh, we should have been here at noon. It's now one o'clock. They uh, close at uh, three, so we now have two hours to explore the site instead of three. But on the upside, Christina got a good nap. <laughs> Guide, guide, almost free. <laughs> almost free. <laughs> almost free. Look at that. You can walk on those steps. Look at that. Look how steep that is. That is pretty. Yeah, it's a little mushy, mushy ground. Look at that. That is just beautiful. Cool. That was a long tunnel. <laughs> <laughs>
Aleppo was founded around 50 BC. Um, but already 150 years later, around 180, um, there was a population boom in this area. And one of the reasons why Koba is, uh, was, was flourishing so much is that it's situated between two pretty large freshwater lakes. And at the time, um, whoever controlled freshwater and trade routes, um, either by river or by, uh, by road, uh, would potentially become a, a huge uh, power factor in the region. Later on, when Chitsun Itza uh, became the new power center, uh, <coughs> Koba struggled to maintain its, uh, its position. But it's a, it's a huge area. We just read that it was what, 70 square kilometers of just structures and buildings and causeways. It's pretty amazing. Pretty amazing. Pretty amazing. <laughs> Some kind of junction. Could, yeah, could be. Yeah, junction. Meeting of roads. Something. Bad. What a beauty. Very nice step pyramid. Good question. Could be like a, a center pillar, and then this maybe was filled with something else. Had we purchased uh, one of those uh, guides, which was could, almost free, he could <laughs> surely have told us what these uh, stone structures was. So we just walked through the, the cool jungle and then all of a sudden this pyramid emerges. Look how steep that is! That is awesome! You can see the sides and the back, it's covered in jungle. Pretty difficult to jump and run up and down these slopes trying to get the ball or whatever through that hoop or ring. That could be uh, could be the rule book. The rules of engagement. <laughs> First you divide two teams. <laughs> whoever loses goes to hell. I don't know. <laughs> Look at that! Just some gorgeous rounded edges. This one is super impressive. Look how steep that is. That is cool. What do you think? Isn't that amazing? Impressive, yeah. Do you think they had like an an architecture meeting and saying someone you know raised his hand and said you know what guys I'm tired of these squared pyramids let's try something different <laughs> let's make them round <laughs> and everyone was like no not you again but then eventually he got his way that's pretty amazing after it was finished everyone was like nah we don't like it <laughs> <laughs> You're fired. <laughs> Sacrifice him. <laughs> that was Koba. 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 Koba was really good. Nice area. Nice area, yeah. So, uh, so uh, yeah.
plan is to uh, go to uh, Valladolid and uh, go for a walk while the sun is still up. Yeah. We have now arrived in Valladolid. Yeah? Yeah. Just checked into the hotel. Mm -hmm. What's the name? Uh, Hotel Maquite Mason. Mm. Five star hotel. Yeah, but it's not five star. No. Good pricing. <laughs> we are we're sitting in the park in uh, in this beautiful colonial um, city, and behind us up there is uh, the cathedral, which is an absolute must see. Unfortunately, it's a little overcast. It would be very pretty in um, in the sunset. Yeah, but um, our plan is to um, to check out some of the really pretty houses and we've been recommended a street up there um, it should have some really nice uh, doors and colorful the whole city is very yeah. colorful so yeah, yeah. So if that is street 50 and it ends, we must be here. So that means, so the park and our hotel should be that way, I think, maybe, yeah, let's do that. How does it feel to have uh, ordered your first dinner in fluent Spanish? Muy bien. Why are we sitting here waiting for food? The first No, the birds are crazy. Listen. want to see any more ruins because tomorrow we are heading for Chichen Itza. Chichen Itza. Yeah and we're looking very much forward to it. So uh, I think we are heading for the hotel mm -hmm. and get some uh, a good night's sleep. So. Hi thank you for watching we hope you enjoyed it. If you did please give our video a huge like. And should you have any questions or comments feel free to post them uh, below. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell to stay updated on the next video. See ya. See ya.
Are we lost? No, we have a map. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's go. <laughs> we may be a little lost. <laughs>